2024 03 Southern Gardens property located at 4609 Bemis Road. This involves five acres. It is currently CG and the request is for a PD and this will be served by County Utilities. Mr. Dillon. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. As you see the overall zoning pattern here, we've noticed plant developments, higher density to the west, north, northeast, across the street, east Hamilton Green most recently. <coughs> Uh, Chris currently CG property as was used for the Southern Gardens. Uh, PD zoning is recommended to allow for a mixture of uh, housing types and, and income levels in these areas. Again, that's part of the Neighborhood Activity Character Center, which pretty much fronts Bemis Corridor here. Are no wetlands on the property to speak of. Now, this was the original site plan submitted with the application. The applicant has since come back and changed it based on feedback from the Planning Commission. So again, this is what was submitted. This is what went to the Planning Commission. This has faced uh, a bit of opposition from the neighbors to the west in that single family residential area. Uh, the concern here was for the height. These are three story buildings. Uh, again, 60 units total, three story buildings. They had shown a reduced parking layout with this co uh, concept. And then after the Planning Commission meeting, they ultimately changed to move the one story community building more adjacent to the west for the neighbors in Glen Laurel. Still 60 units, but they increased their parking as well based on all, of, all the comments they heard from the Planning Commission. So, still, staff recommends uh, approval of this. It had no technical issues with it again. And Planning Commission ultimately recommended approval 5-1, even with the original site plan. So, this is a aerial view from the property looking to the south. This is a drone footage. You see that the property is more or less vacant and abandoned. And as we transition more to the west, you'll see the Glen Laurel subdivision start to peek through there. Those are single family homes, again, a PD zoning there. Now we move to the northwest, you see the duplexes for Patriots Place. This is another PD zoning. And then as we continue to transition to the north, you see the Patriots Place apartments, uh, two story along the western property line, three story along the northern. You see a car wash, which is commercial highway zoning. And we see commercial zoning across the street with the Domino's and Subway. And then across the street again, the famous uh, Hamilton Green townhomes, 80, 80 units there uh, before transitioning back down looking south to the abandoned property, uh, which you'll see here in just a second. This is that property from a ground level view. And again, Glen Lower West, you'll notice its location with the site plan in your upper right corner. This is an approximate 30 foot elevated view. It's trying to estimate, again, what it might view from a balcony of these apartment complexes. These are the duplexes to the north, again, the duplexes and the apartments. And again, you see the car wash in the apartments there, and Hamilton Green Town Halls to the east. So, again, this was the original with that buildings located to the west. And this is the updated site plan with the buildings north and south in the one-story community building. You'll notice set back 85 to 97 feet from the property line. So with that, GLPC still recommended 5-1 to option 1 for the <coughs> site plan. TRC reviewed option 2 that was submitted and still uh, finds no technical issues with it. Any questions for Mr. Dillon? All right, hearing none, 